Oh, hello, hello, track and field fan. I come to talk about track and field today. In the glean, it says Shelly and Fraser Price use her first 100 meter race of the season to send a strong statement of intent to the rest of the field, vying for her world championship title. Fraser Price stormed to victory in a new world leading time of 10.67. Could you believe that, people? At the Kip Kina Classic in Nurumbi, Kenya today. Egypt, Basan Imida was well beaten, crossing the tape next in 11.02, while American Shannon Ray was third in 11.33. World Honor 20. 200 meter champion and Olympic silver medalist Christine M. Boma was chasing her with 50 meter to go, but pull up with an injury and did not finish. Fraser price time is just seven hundred of a second off the 10.60 personal bear. She clocked in in Lausanne, Switzerland last August. So let's talk about this track and field fan. Shelly and Fraser Price, her very first season opener. She did a 10.67 in a head win. Oh my gosh. I hear Shelly and Fraser Price said she's going to be running 10.50 and 10.40. And I was like, at 34 years old? Wow. This tell me that as you get older, you get stronger. <laughs> Obviously, for Shelly and Fraser Price, her body is getting stronger as she get older. And she's not burned out because she was a high school star like that in track and field. So that's why she's getting stronger. Plus, she takes some time out to have baby. So look at these years that she weren't a star. She was just running in high school. And she takes time out to have baby. The Lord is repaying her for those years she has missed. Could you believe that? 10.67. Elaine Price, I mean, <laughs> Elaine Thompson Hera, her season opener was 10.89. So Shelly and Fraser is trying to tell, send out threat to all the under meter ladies. Let them know, listen here, I am in good shape. I am the one to beat this season. Watch out, Elaine Thompson Hera. I am coming for you. I am going to get to this world record first, the 100 meter world record. These two, they bring the best out of each other. Iron sharpen iron. These two, when they run together this season, expect something miraculous. They are going to bring the best out of each other. Shelly and Fraser Price and Elaine Thompson Hera. I'm not sure if it was a good move Elaine made by leaving the MVP club, but she should know and go training with her husband. She should know if it's a good move or not. But the shape that Shelly and Fraser Price is in, my God, she is in top notch shape for the world championship later this year. She is trying to win the goal. That's what she's trying to say. So these lady better get their training R. Where is Shakari Richardson? She's been missing in action. Maybe she turned an actress now. We don't know. But Shelly and Fraser Price, unbelievable at 34 years old. She have a son. It showed me that mom, don't stop you from accomplish what you need to accomplish. You can accomplish all things, even when you have 10 kids. So never let kids stop you because she is on her A game at this level. And she said this is her last year running. No, she needs to do a next Olympic, maybe two more Olympics. Because she look like as she get older, she is getting faster. And some people is like that as they get older, they look younger. In her case, as she get older, she get faster. So big up to Shelly and Fraser Price for such an amazing first 100 meter opener. She knew it was coming. She said she was going to run good. She was ready for the competition, but Christine M. Boma pulled up 50 meter to finish the race. She was trying to stay with the mommy rocket and she get rocket blast. 
<laughs> I'm sorry. I don't mean it in a bad way. I don't feel bad that she's injured, but don't you ever as a youngin try to stay with somebody that fast. You could get hurt yourself. So we're going to, I wish Christy and Boma a speedy recovery because she is very good, but I hope lesson learned. Don't try to go as fast as Shelly and Fraser. Don't try to keep up with her, run your own race. Don't pay attention to her too. The last time when Shakari was in a race with Elaine Thompson era and Shelly and Fraser Price and Sharika Jackson, she come in dead last because she know if she tried to keep up with them, it would have been crazy because she can't keep up with them. These ladies speed is on the next level. They run the same time like some guys. Some guys don't even run as fast as they do. So yes. And Boma, let's speed to recover for you. Don't try to keep up with Mama Rocket. You will get Rocket Blast. So yes, don't try to keep up with her. Run your own race. You're still young and you have time to accomplish all that Shelly and I've accomplished, but Shelly and Fraser is on the next level. She and Elaine Thompson era, they're in a league all by themselves. These ladies taking track and field to the next level. We never seen ladies this fast in our entire life. The ladies before was very fast, but we don't know if there was on steroid or what. But we hope for a good season for Shelly and Fraser Price. And we hope she continue to improve as she run and somebody break the record. Let a Jamaican break the record. This is good for Jamaica. And it's not because I'm Jamaican. That's why I'm saying that. this is good for Jamaica, for the woman to have the Jamaican record. And we already have the record for Usain Bolt on four by one, 200 meter and 100 meter. Thank you so much. For watching please subscribe like comment tell me what you think about this very fast blazing 10.6 to 7 as an opener this is unbelievable that somebody could open their season so fast we never see it in history this is the first time a woman ever opened their season so fast they first race 10.6 to 7 it is it is